If you saw my series ranking review for the Leprechaun series, then you know exactly why you're here. You want to know why the hell do I like this movie that I'm about to review so much? I'll let you know. This is my review for... Leprechaun Origins. Now, the story of Leprechaun Origins is completely cliche. It has four friends going up to a cabin, and shit just goes down when the Leprechaun starts attacking, and they have this town sort of secret that helps the film move along. And it's so cliche, so stupid, and it, the color of the film is all gray and miserable, but I liked it. When I was younger, I just wanted to see a Leprechaun movie that was dark, gritty, and had creature-like aspects to the Leprechaun, and I really dug the fact that they did that for this film. I also dug some of the acting. The guy who plays the best friend to the main character in Freddy vs. Jason's in this, and he does a good job. Also, I do like the atmosphere, even though it's all gray and musky and just miserable. I think it works really well for the film. It's not supposed to be taking like lighthearted cheeriness. It's supposed to be taking like dark, greasy, violent horror. And it has a poor plot. Some of the acting's okay, but most of it's pretty shitty. The whole surviving girl trope is just grown thin and old by this point, and I just didn't care for that. And the fact that they barely have anything to do with this leprechaun's gonna want his gold back. We're gonna frame it and make it look like they took it. Trying to appease the leprechaun. But I dug it. Fun little film. Overall, I give Leprechaun Origins a 3 out of 5. Lion Brian Gatto, host of Horror Show Movie Reviews. Make sure to like my Facebook page in the description below and to leave comments and subscribe.